thought to be a very busy next year and a half. We're obviously going to start with that coordinated election just coming up in November and then into next year. We have the presidential primary in the springtime and everyone's already talking about that general election in 2024. But to make sure you are ready for all of those elections today is used as a reminder to register or update your voter information if you moved or changed your name this year. According to the 2020 U.S. Census data, as many as one in four eligible Americans are not registered to vote. So the El Paso County Clerk and Recorder wants to make sure you have your voice heard. A lot of our municipalities and our school districts are going to the ballot um, this upcoming November. And they're asking a number of different questions in regards to um, can we sit there and increase property taxes or can we keep excess TABOR revenues? Election day is November 7th. As a reminder, you can register to vote through election day and those ballots will be mailed out to you in about four weeks. Reporting live in Colorado Springs, Kasha Carriage, KKTV 11 News.